Oh boy, here we go. Oh, hit you with my axe, bro. Come at me. What's up, Vault Dwellers? This is KG48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Fallout 76 Beta. Last video, I left the vault, grabbed a couple items, saw a couple people, nobody killed me, made me very happy. Um, and now we are going to just go along with this quest line. Um, I don't, we gotta go find the Overseer's Camp. So I'm guessing I need to just come down this way. I don't see anything on the map. Let's see if we can uh, look on the map here. All right, so is that me? That's gotta be me. Um, oh, these are other players, aren't they? Yeah. So let's come on down here. I think we just got to get off this mountain anyway. So let's get over here. Now, anytime you sprint, you're using AP. So action points. So you got to remember that for Vats. Now, Vats is Q, by the way. So. All right. So it looks like there's a cow over here. I don't know what that cow's all about. I'd like to kill something. What is that? Is that something I can kill? I don't think that's a player. Yeah, it's a player. Never mind. I am not going to kill players. I'm not going to kill Night Reaper. Come on. He spells Night Reaper with two E's. How could I kill that guy? Now, can you go off the path? Yeah, you can. Okay, good. I was worried. I was kind of being forced on the path there. All right, so we got some water over here. I wonder if I could drink it. Oh, there's something over there. There's like a little, um, little dock, and it looked like there's some stuff on the dock. So let's see if we can get over there and grab some, grab some supplies. Uh, turpentine and duct tape. Ooh, what is that? Fire cap? Okay. Uh, toaster? Alright, I got a toaster, guys. We will be having toast tonight. Um, Rhododendron? Rhododendron, I guess? Maybe? Yes, no, maybe so? Can we take anything in there? It doesn't look like it. Can we drink that water? Dirty water? I don't think we should drink that until we absolutely have to. Let's get out of it, too. Probably don't want to be swimming around in it. Okay. Alright, so that is... Um, that is not the... Oh, wow. I'm all the way down here now. All right. Let's just go here. We're going to go to this thing. Whatever it is. Do we... We, we must have a... Oh, that's where my, that's where I got to go. Okay. Yeah. The Overseer's Camp showing up right there. That's the uh, quest marker. But we're going to check out this little... Uh, I don't know. This oil drill or whatever it is first. I want to do a little bit of scavenging before I go along with the quest line. I'd like to get a gun. That would be nice. Oh, boy. A lot of shooting going on. There's a whole lot of shooting going on. All right. It doesn't look like there's anything over here. I saw something over here. There we go. All right. A cap, a ball peen hammer, and a scalp scalpel. And I got 3C, whatever that is. Maybe that's the money, the bottle caps, or I don't know. There's so much I don't know about this game. All right. So we're at the lumber mill. So I'm guessing this would be a good place. To ah! Hey, here you freaking tick. That's a tick. That's so gross. Oh, my God. That was gross. Look at that. That's a giant freaking tick. Oh, I'm going to take his blood sack. That's not what I want to do. Yeah, we got to watch out for enemies, of course. I, I totally forgot about enemies. All right. Oh, something's outside. Nothing else over here. Oh, what do we got here? Yep, we'll take that wood. Wood scraps. More wood scraps. I'm going to be doing so much building in this game. It's going to be awesome. I'm a builder, guys. I like to build. Nothing in the tool chest, huh? That sucks. Got unlucky with that one. Uh, more wood pile. Okay. It's going to take us some time to get used to what I can loot and what I can't. Uh, nothing. Got some cleaner. Got a bunch of rounds. We got gunpowder. Uh, blood pack. Ale. A bone cutter. Bone saws ready. Man, where's the guns? Where's all the freaking guns? I need me some guns, people. All right, let's go in this place over here. See if we can find some guns. I've got I've got some ammo. I just need the I need the guns to use it. Go ahead and. Pick some of that. I wonder if you get experience for picking that stuff. That'd be cool if you did. Alright, what do we got in here? Gunpowder, screwdriver. Uh, oh, a tinkerer's workbench. Okay, so that's where you make the ammo. I can make a harpoon. I can make railway spikes. Okay. Fair enough. Tinkerer's workbench. 
I'm assuming we'll be able to make those for our own base as well. Stim pack, dirty water. Duct tape. That looks like more wood, right? Yep. Wood pile. I'm liking this game so far, guys. I'm liking it a lot more than I thought I was going to. When that when the one dude I was talking to said, you know, it feels like a Fallout MMO, I was like, what? You know, I was, uh, okay, well, that, that sounds like something I'd be interested in, you know? So we'll see where it goes, but I'm having a lot of fun with it so far. I know there's a lot of problem with speed hackers and stuff and all that kind of... I'm not going to worry about that. If I start getting killed and it affects my fun, then I'll stop playing, but... Um, they said they'll fix it for launch, so I don't think it'll be a problem for long, hopefully. Alright, let's head to the quest guy. Or girl. Can we pick these? No. Oh boy, hold on. Vats! Okay, I don't think I used Vats correctly because that was weird. How do I... What does Vats do? Um, how does Vats work? I don't know. Is that, it's not, Vats isn't going to be able to stop gameplay, right? Because it's a, it's a multiplayer game. Oh, something's running around out there. What is that? What is that? What do we got out here? There's some glowy mushrooms over there? Alright, as I'm hitting vats, my AP's going down, but it's not putting me in vats. That's weird. Maybe you gotta have something in the area. That's probably what it is. I think last time I did, there was a, a cat in the area. I didn't want to kill it, but... Alright, Vixen Homestead. Did I hear rides? Scorched. I don't know what scorched are. Tinkerer's workbench. Scalpel. Nothing else. We got something over here? Uh, something over here. Oh, that's just buggy mushrooms or something. Or... Or a um, radio... I think that's a radioactive butterfly. So there's that. Oh, here we go. Let's fight something. Oh, no. Those are players. Damn it. Oh, I hope they're not going to shoot me. Uh, scorched. So these scorched guys are all being killed. Armor workbench. Okay. So I'd like to be able to kill some of these scorched guys, but they're just being wasted by these, uh, these guys over here. So Coffee and... Dog tags. Okay. Alright, let's see what else we got in here. I'd really like to play around bats and find out how it's how it works. Hello. Anything I can loot in here? It does not look like there's anything I can loot in here. I could sit down. I could go to the bathroom. I could go out on the porch. Oh my god. That is just awful. Let's take a beer. I'm going to need a beer after seeing that. So I guess if I came here by myself before other people got here, they'd be scorched everywhere. Message to Sammy. Responders, responders don't know crap. Every night... Uh, there's more of them in the sky. Brotherhood... Sorry, I just hit my mic. Uh, Brotherhood warned them, warned us all. Defiance has fallen, they said. What the hell's that mean? Supplies running low. May try to get, get to Abbey. Way over the mountain. Free states have got to know more. Sammy, you read this. Get to Abbey. Straight east of the Red Rocket Megastop. Uh, she knows the Brotherhood of Steel better than anyone. My angels look after you. Be sure uh, as shit. Nothing else will. Okay. I will take that. Oh, I'm going to take the pillow. Cool. Alright. So is that showing up on our next quest thing? Yep. Oh we God, we never even got to the we never even got to the quest marker. This is just some random place. I thought this is where I was supposed to go for the quest. No, this is some random freaking building. Well this is kind of spooky. Look at this freaking bridge here, man. This is like uh Ichabod Crane's bridge where the headless horseman chased him down, right? That's what this reminds me of. This is spooky as hell. Should we go out and fight whatever that is? He's on the other side of the river. It looks like they're all over the place. So, w unless they're corpses. Maybe they're not corpses. Maybe they're just mushrooms. I'll, gr I'll grab some glowing mushrooms. Why not? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. A baseball grenade. Whatever the hell that is. 
Freaking baseball grenade. All right, I want to fight something, man. Yeah, they're not... They're not scorched things. They're just glowing mushrooms. Can we uh, cut up any of these trees? No. All right, fair enough. Now, I think we're right by the quest, uh, quest area now. Okay. What do we got up here? Bunch of people. Let's put this away. Um, is this the quest thing? Yeah, it is. So we got a cooking station. We've got, um, overseers, log, a overseers bunch of ammo, log. purified Sounds water. It looks like a bunch of supplies. I knew this wasn't going to be the Appalachia I remembered, but... Mutated animals? Haywire bots? No people so far. We have to be ready to rebuild in... What I can confirm is... Hostile territory. Fortunately, vault Tech was prepared. You see this? The cooking station? The stash box, the workbenches, all built with the camp. You need a home base out there. The construction and assembly mobile platform is designed to give you one. Just add resources, planning, and a little elbow grease. When you move your camp, everything you've built is stored, ready to be placed back down in the new area. Use this to establish a foothold whenever you're in unfamiliar territory. I've left my camp behind so you can use it. I know I'm breaking my own advice by not taking it with me. But after seeing Appalachia for myself, I need to make sure every resident of 76 has a safe haven they can start from. I'll make do without it. If it's still standing, the town of Flatwoods is further down this road. Find me there. This is the Overseer, signing off. Okay, so it sounds like that camp thing is really freaking cool. Um, all you have to do is bring up your pit boy and then press Z, and you can put down your camp. Now I can't put down my camp here because someone already, someone else already did. And this is that lady's camp, like that she left behind, right? As a matter of fact, that's probably hers. I thought that was another player's. It's not. It's probably hers. So uh, let's take a look and see if we can do some crafting. Um, so we can't make. We need boiled water. Okay, how do we get boiled water? That's what we need. All drinks. Dirty, uh, boiled water is too dirty water. Okay, so how do we get more... Can we just go get more water, or... I don't know if you can actually take water out of, like, the river. Um, let me go see what I can do with the river really quick. I'm just kind of curious. I'd like to be able to boil some water. Uh, so, yeah, drink... Oh, collect! Radiation reduces your maximum health. Uh, use right away to cure it. So, is that just giving me, like, bottles? Like, is that just, like... Magically giving me dirty water. Okay, so I have four right now. Five, six, seven, eight. I don't know how many. I should have a lot of dirty water now. Yep, 31. Okay, cool. So you can just collect the dirty water. You don't actually need the bottles. I don't know what you're holding it in, but... And also, my food and drink is on the screen right above my AP now. I don't think it was there before, but... I don't know, I could be wrong. So let's go ahead and boil up some water. Let's see what we can do with these, uh, with these crafting stations. All right, all drinks, boiled water, uh, make. Can we do a few at a time? Getting some experience there too. Need wood as well to um, obviously get the fire going. Uh, space, I don't see how to make more than one. So just spam that. There we go. All right, made a bunch of boiled water. Let's see if we can make some uh, uh, simple suit flower tea. Ah, I got eight point, we got eight experience for that. And another two experience for some reason. Maybe you get eight experience for the first time and then two after that. I'm not really sure. Okay. All food. We can now make some fire cap soup. Let's do that. Let's make some glowing fungus soup. Now, would you eat glowing fungus soup? I guess if you were really hungry, you would. Um, healing. Cure disease forest. Maybe fire cap, blood leaf. I don't know where to get blood leaf from. Or uh, Snaptail Reed. we got to figure out where to get those two from. Um, plants. It's kind of weird. Um, prepared. Oh, okay. So, yeah, utility. Vegetable starch. Okay. All right. 
Please exit. Now let's um. No, we're not really hungry, so now let's go. Let's drink some boiled water. Do we leave any left? Um, first of all, let's see what the boiled water gives us. Five reds, ten hit points, fifteen water. There we go. So we are getting some reds. Um, now we do have rad away somewhere. Um, at least I, I thought we had rad away, didn't we? Yeah, rad away. But we only have one rad away. Um, now rad away gives us disease resistance. Negative 50. Uh, removes 300 rads. Okay. Increase thirst, hunger, and chance for disease. All right. We got a lot to learn on this game, man. We got a lot to learn. How many rads is that? Usually you can tell from up here. I think I'm almost 200 rads, maybe. I can't. I have no way of really telling. All right. Well, whatever. Let's come over here and check out the armor workbench. Light armor. Um, okay. All right. So condition, damage resistance, um... Uh, energy resistance. Okay, yeah, let's just make a bunch of this armor. Actually, you know what? Let's make pants first. Always make pants. Oh, you don't make pants. You, like, you make leg armor. All right, forget it. Let's just make the chest piece. Because we don't we don't have a lot of leather. I don't know where we get more leather, though. Um, level one. So I don't think we can make that any higher. Space. There we go. And now we're out of leather. But we got some, we got some experience for that. We got a challenge. Oh, we can make some more leather. Cool. These only take uh, one leather. There we go. We just gotta figure out where to get leather. I'm assuming we can hunt animals for leather. That'd probably be the best way to get it. That's my, you know, survivalist talking, I guess. Alright, apparel. Leather piece. Plus 5, plus 10. And then plus 2, plus 2. Cool. Oh, look at that. Check out my leather. Oh, he's got leather too. Alright. Weapons. Can we make a gun? Blunt melee, edged melee, pipe guns, throwing weapons. Oh, we can make a pipe pistol. Bolt action. Wait, pipe bolt action? Pipe revolver or syringe? Okay. This is damage. Uh, first of all, these take 30. Yeah. So this takes 45. I don't have any of those rounds. So it's going to have to be one of these two. So that's 12 damage, fire rate. All right. So that's a, that's a rifle, basically. Do I want a rifle or a gun? Like a pistol. That's a tough call, man. That is a tough call. I think I want to... Wait, that's a pistol, but I think it's supposed to be like a rifle. I'm going to make the regular pistol. There we go. Let's go ahead and do that. And that will degrade as we use it. What do we need for a syringe? Oh, we need... Uh, wait. Syringe? Syringer, not a syringe. I guess it shoots syringes. We don't have any syringes. Oh, no. Don't, don't cancel. No, 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 no. Um, blunt or edged? Let's go edged. Combat knife or hatchet. Now, is the hatchet for cutting down trees or weapons? I mean, this is a weapon bench, so... No, it says medium speed. Okay, so this is faster, but this does more damage. I'm going to go with the hatchet. Oh, we can make a combat knife, too. We're getting experience. Why not? There we go. Oh, we can, can we make even more stuff? Blunt? No, a board. <laughs> we can make a board. Throwing weapons. Throwing knives. Eh, I'm not going to mess around with throwing knives. Alright, so let's take a look at our weapons now. And we've got... Let's let's put the... Let's leave the machete... No, let's... Yeah, let's leave the machete as one. Let's put the hatchet as the next one. Can you choose which where to save it? I don't think you can. I'm going to have to kind of figure this out. I got all that stuff saved. Now if I press that, um, it's one, two, and three. Okay, that's what I wanted it as. So, one, two, and three. Okay, cool. All right, cool. All right, let's put that away. And that is all of the workbenches. So I think we need to uh, keep on keeping on. I do want to put down the base. I think we're going to do that next episode, though. I want an episode just for putting down the base. So let's head this way and see if we can get to the next camp. Are we going to make it there in time? I don't know. We don't have a lot of time left. But I am going to kill anything I come across. That's not people. I'm not going to mess with players. Oh, a two-headed Brahmin. I wonder if I can get some leather from it. Uh, take. Why can't I take that? Take, take, take. Take, take, take. I can't take that. All right. Fair enough. Let's mess with that Brahmin. I don't want this guy to think I'm trying to, like, kill him. Might as well pick all these uh, flowers as well. I'm sure we're going to need them for stuff. They do go bad, but that's okay. 
There seems to be a lot of them. Where'd that Brahmin go? I think he got scared. Alright guys, I, I don't know what happened with the taking stuff, but I went to transfer and then I went back and I, I could take the stuff after that. I'm not really sure. Probably just a bug. Let's see if we could chop down some trees. Nope. Oh boy, here we go. Oh! I hit you with my axe, bro! Come at me! I like this axe because it makes me feel like uh, Rick from the Walking Dead comic. Alright, we should probably get back on the road. Yeah, let's just... Oh, it's the road's right here. Alright, let's keep on keeping on. I, I want to make it to the next quest, dude, before... Uh, or lady, before the end of the video, so let's do that. Flip lighter and scissors. I wonder if we could use the flip lighter instead of wood. Well, the wood's for... Not for starting fires, it's for, like, you know... Basically fuel for the fire, so... A flip lighter wouldn't help us with that. It's not like you need something to start fires in this game. That guy's got a bat. Sweet bat, bro. Ooh, Molotov cocktail. Can't go in there. We've got some water here. That's nice. Now, how do I get my uh, thirst thing back? I don't know. There we go. We're full. Okay, fair enough. Oh, here we are. We're at the lodge. Ah, uh, we're not. We're not to the quest. We're not going to make it to the quest giver. Let's explore this lodge, and then we'll we'll uh, make it to the quest giver next video, and then we'll um maybe we'll plop down a base somewhere in the woods over here. I don't know. Plop down a base somewhere. Might be pretty fun. Okay. Dinner plate. Yeah, there's no loot lying around like in Fallout games, which is fine. Cotton yarn. Anything else in here? Plastic knife. Game feels a little sluggish compared to Fallout 4. I don't think it's lag, but it could be. Table knife. What's up, guys? Oh, you found some skeletons. Radio, don't care about the radio. Empty lockers. Well, we got a ladle, so that's good. Anything in here? Oh, right away. Beautiful. Need me some right away. I can't wait for this game to come out like full full blast, man. I'm having a good time. And the extra people do not bother me one bit. I'm an, I'm an MMO player. This is like second nature to me. Military grade circuit board. I mean, this is going to bother some people. Ain't going to bother me though. Mentats. Hey, what are you doing, bro? You close the door on me. Uh, got anything over here? No. Uh, nothing over there? Okay. Alright, you know what, guys? I think it's just about time to call it. We are going to call this one here. I don't even know when the timer went off. I lost track. I think, it's about, I think this is about my uh, normal time to call it. But um, next video, we're going to head to the Quest Giver, and then we are going to... Um, and then we're going to probably set up our camp somewhere. Like that mobile, that camp thing. The C-A-M-P. I think it's called a camp. So, anyway guys, if you end up enjoying the video, don't forget guys, if you... Ooh, Survivor Story. Willie May. I pressed the button. Hush. I think it's recording now. Shush. Hello. Hello there. Oh, I think it's working. <laughs> I hate these things. This is Willie May. And I was asked to talk a bit about my life since the war to help educate future children someday. I think that's nice. I thought I'd just watch my programs and entertain the grandkids in my retirement. But that didn't turn out to be the case. I'm just glad they all made it to the vault in time, you see. When I saw it in a dream, I knew my prayers were answered. My husband, Frank, used to work in the mines. Just a bit before the war, there was news of tremors. And he didn't come home. I don't know what happened to him or why he never came home for sure. And between you and me, I'm fine. Since the war, I've just read my old newspaper and listened to music. It's very peaceful, for once. 
which is just right nice by me. Ever hear of the Watoga Times Atomic Lottery? The winner got ten years' worth of Blamco mac and cheese, and Salisbury steak, and, and Nuka-Cola, of course. I played that lottery for twenty years, and I finally won the month before the war. It lasted only eight years, though. But who can you complain to? By the time it ran out, I had heard the responders' radio broadcast, so I went out to find them and get supplies. Bless their hearts. Well, I'm going home now. For a bit, anyways. How do I turn this thing off? Oh, blast these things. Not this button. Not this one. Oh, oh here it is. Wow. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that, man. That was long as hell. Ooh. An o what is that? O opossum or something? That's crazy. Yeah, did you see I got the um I got hide off of that uh that one deer I killed? Oh boy. Oh, run. Come on, gotta get him. Gotta get him. Yeah, that's what you get. I'm gonna take that old possum meat. I'm gonna chow down on that tonight. Boy, um that took us really yeah, that was a long, long winded freaking thing well i hope you guys enjoyed it if you do want to see more of this make sure you leave those likes and thumbs up and let me know in the comments all that good stuff thank you very much for watching i'll see you next time and until then take it easy